Christianity is not a crutch. Christianity is not for the weak at heart, the faint of heart. Christianity is for those that are willing to go, I am not ashamed of Jesus Christ. I will shine for Him no matter what. I will believe what the Lord said and I will stand on it. I don't care if it takes a day. I don't care if it takes a year. I don't care if it's 12 years and I'm sitting there about to get rolled in to an operation that I don't even know what's going to happen, but I do know that God is with me and that is what I hold on to. And I know that God is for me. What can be against me? I dealt with cystic fibrosis since I was a baby. So it's been 33 years dealing with cystic fibrosis every day, twice a day for for hours, every day of my life, I've done physio and medicine and pills and, and insulin and things like that and gone in the hospital and ever since I became a Christian, I learned right from the get-go that, that the Bible is God's will for me and everything Jesus did was the will of God. And Jesus healed all the sick all the time. I believe that Jesus paid for healing, that it's in the plan of salvation, not just for our spirit, but also for our bodies to be in health. You know, everyone loves testimony, but nobody likes to test to get the testimony. It's so easy to praise God when things are going good, but it's when things aren't going good and it gets worse and worse and worse and the doctors say there's no hope and you're gonna die, you're gonna die, there's no hope, the numbers, the statistics. When you're told that God isn't real and you're, and you're mocked to your face, people think you're crazy and gone off the deep end because you say you're a Christian. All your doctors don't believe. What do you do then? What do you do when you don't have the report? You don't see the symptom-free body. You see disease looking you in the face every second of every day. And you can sit there and go, God is bigger than you and I'm gonna to choose to praise God, and I'm gonna to choose to praise God, and I'm gonna to choose to praise God, because my God is great. My God created the heavens and the earth. My God said that I'm his daughter, and he loves me, and he loves to dwell in me, and he will always cause me to triumph. My God says that I'm a more than an overcomer. My God says that he will cause me to, to, to overcome anything. There's nothing that can separate me from the love of God. There's nothing that can separate you from the love of God. Sickness is the same thing as sin. It's not God's will. It's, it's not from God. And we want to do everything to fight it, in the natural and the spiritual. But when, when, when it abounds, grace abounds much more. If we choose to believe and cling on to that hope and cling on to Jesus, and we can go through the fire and not even feel the fire because we're on fire with God. The Bible says, let the weak say I'm strong. As somebody that's standing on the finished work of Jesus, it's so important to just continue to cast down every thought, every suggestion, every doubt that says you're not healed, you're not gonna make it. We could feel fear trying to get on us but we don't need to receive it into us. 